In this tutorial, I'll explain how I made the video of Elliot giving a short speech on multitasking. We used a phone to record it, um, and we made a separate video for each part of the speech. Uh, you can see them here. We have the introduction, and then each reason that he gives, and then the conclusion. This way, um, Elliot could take some time to look at his outline and think of what he was going to say before each part. So, we ended up with these uh, five clips, uh, and I'm going to cut a little bit, cut some parts uh, of these, and then just put them together and make uh, one video. Um, the software I'm using is called Shotcut, and you can find it here at shotcut.org. So let's open Shotcut, and this is what it would probably look like. It might be slightly different on your computer, and we want to make a playlist. So click Playlist. And then let's make this a bit smaller so we can drag our clips in there. Okay, so we put the first one. Actually opens it here, so I'm just gonna drag it again. Okay. And then number two. We four and five okay we can close this so now we have all our clips here and we're going to work on editing them before we make any changes let's um, save our project let's give it a name uh, let's see each okay save all right and now um we're gonna edit each each clip so start with the first one right click open as clip right and i want to uh cut a little bit of the beginning so i'm as you can see He's not talking in the beginning, so I'm just going to cut that. So I'm going to go up to, let's see, somewhere here. And then I know at the end, there's a little bit of space as well. Okay, this is where he stops talking, so I'm just going to leave it here. And now, go here, where you see this tick, this and this says update. So go ahead and click update. Okay, and now our first clip uh, will be in this form. Let's go to the next one again. Right click, open as clip. Okay. Okay, um, so actually this is done, but I'm just going to show you one more thing because sometimes you might want to cut 
from the middle. So if you want to cut from the middle, what you do is, so for example, this last one, maybe we want to cut from the middle. Uh, hang on, let me save this first. Okay, I want to save the changes and then I'm just going to show you. I'm If I want to cut from the middle, I'm just going to put it here again. Okay, because I need to select two different parts from this video. So, for example, I want, um, I might want this. And then from this one, I might want this bit here. Okay, and this I'm skipping some of it. Or maybe I want from here until the end. Okay? So now I have a little bit here and then a little bit here. So if you need to make, uh, to select different fragments from different videos, just uh, add that video, uh, that clip again uh, in the playlist. All right, but now I'm going to remove this one um, and I'm going to leave that as it was. And right, open as clip. So yeah, this is how it should be. Update. Okay, so now, now it's done. And see, now we are here on source, so you can see the clip itself. If you click on program, you can see the whole project. And here it tells you this is where clip one starts, this is where clip two starts, and so on. So you can see all five clips, and then you can watch the whole thing and see if you like it or not. Okay? Okay, now if you like it, um, it's time to encode it. So right now uh, we saw that when you save this, so we save this as speech MLT. So MLT is the project. It's not a video that we can watch yet. So for now it's an MLT. And we need to turn this into an MP4 file which you can watch as a video. So we click encode and you can see here that it's an mp4 format which is fine we don't need to change anything except for the resolution we want to change the resolution because this is very high and it's going to give us a very um, a very big file it's going to take a lot of space so we're going to make this 1024 and this one 576 right and now just click encode file we give it a name We save it in the same folder and you can see it here. This is the jobs, the jobs panel and you can see that it's just started. It's now at 1%. Um, this is going to take a while. It depends on how big your video is, but it takes uh, at least 10, 15 minutes. Um, so you can just leave it and go do something else. Also, your computer might be a bit slow while this is uh, happening. It depends. Again, it depends on your computer. Okay, so I'm back. Um, and we can see now that this is done. If we go to our folder where I saved it, See, no, that's not it. This. You can see the video that we made here. And now it can open with um, whatever your 
or media layers. Some people like to focus on one task at a time. So now we have our video. If you watch the video and then you find something else that you don't like, you can still edit it, but you're going to have to encode it again. So if you want to change it again, uh, you go to the MLT file and then you open this. And then you just start, you're going to see the playlist again. And you can update, change and update the playlist. And then you encode it as a new video.